You can totally like see the lights from my vanity through the tees in my hair. Hey guys, so today I am going to film a haul video for you from um, Bath and Body Works and then I have just like a couple things, like literally like three things that I got from Forever 21 whenever I was going to Bath and Body Works. Um, I was just stocking up on like my fall fragrances, so like candles, hand soaps, hand sanitizers, um, I got some car scents and then also a couple of like the little wallflowers for the rooms. Um, and so I thought I'd just share that with you guys because as I said before, fall is like my favorite time of year. I absolutely adore anything with pumpkin scent. So I do always try to stock up on it like as soon as it comes out at Bath and Body Works because yeah, they have like the really great sales, you know, where you can like buy two for 22 now on the three wick candles. But a lot of the times by the time that those sales roll around and by the time I can make it to the store, they are totally sold out. So this year I just planned ahead and I went ahead and just bought everything that I needed. I had a few different coupons as well, so I actually got a pretty like fantastic deal on all of this and I just thought I'd share it with you guys and share like my favorite fall scents uh, with you as well. So uh, I guess let's just go ahead and get started. So I actually have um, two big Bath and Body Works sacks, so we'll just start with the first one and just go from there. It looks like in this first sack is where most of the hand soaps are. And I guess that they were the five for 15 or the seven for 20. So I just got five right now because I don't go through them like super quick. Um, and I know that whenever I like go overboard with them, I end up having like scents left over like through different seasons. So I was like, okay, I'm just gonna do the five. And then if I need some later, I can just go back and pick up a couple more or whatever. So I got three of the pumpkin cupcake scents. Um, like I said, this is my favorite one for the ones that Bath & Body Works has come out with so far this season. So I've definitely stocked up on these. For my other two scents, I went with the um, pumpkin caramel latte, which again, it's the deep cleansing antibacterial soaps. So those were uh, my five for 15. And moving on to wall fragrances, I stocked up on, I got the four, I think it was uh, four for 20 on them or it was like six for 24. I can't remember exactly, but it was some kind of sale they had going on with them. Two in the pumpkin cupcake again, cause it's my favorite scent. And then I got one in the pumpkin caramel latte. And then I got my last one is the pumpkin, um, sorry, it's the blueberry pumpkin patch, which I actually have one of these candles burning right now. Uh, I posted a photo of that candle to my Facebook page and to my Instagram. I think that the blueberry pumpkin patch is like the best transitional like scent because it still has like that fresh blueberry scent to it but then it's got the fall pumpkin. I just, I absolutely love it. Um, if you haven't gotten a chance to go check it out, I would definitely say to run down to um, your local Bath and Body Works and check out the pumpkin or sorry, oh. I don't know how many times I'm gonna mess that up. Blueberry pumpkin patch. So to go along with my wallflowers, I did get a fall one. Um, I had just one that I've been using for a long time. It's just like a little owl one because I adore owls, but I figured that I would get something a little bit more fall appropriate. So I grabbed this pumpkin one because I thought it was really pretty, you know, with the gold and everything, just, just to do something different for the different seasons. So I did pick this up as well. Then sticking with that whole um, fall theme, I grabbed this pumpkin carving party, which it's a candle sleeve, and it was pretty inexpensive. It was $5.50, so I didn't think it was too bad. I've got like a little um, center kind of like decorative bowl piece that I have on the island in my kitchen, and so I thought that this would look really great in the middle of it, and then just like throw some more decor stuff around it, but I picked this up as well for my candle. Slowly getting to the bottom of this bag. This is my fantastic receipt. I feel like one of those um, like extreme couponers or something. But anyways. Um, I'm just gonna go ahead and let you guys know that these are gonna be a lot of like repeat uh, scents because I am like a habitual buyer. So when I find something I really like, I'll buy like seven of it and like seven different colors or you know just obviously in this case the same scent but yeah I bought two of the pumpkin cupcake ones because these were actually the last two they had left in the store I have a couple more because I had bought some earlier in the week when they first put them back out so I've got those and then I got the sweet clementine antibacterial pocket sanitizer and then the other two are the 
um, pumpkin caramel latte ones, which are the same as the hand soaps that I got. Then for the car fragrances um, and the refills, I bought, they had buy three, get one free, so I got all of them are the pumpkin cupcake scents. Um, I already had one of them and I really liked it. My car is like black on black leather interior and then the outside is black as well, so it gets really hot in there. And so sometimes when I have these, like, and they get that warm, they don't smell very good. But this, like, even after our lovely, like, 100 degree weather here in Arkansas, smells fantastic. So picked up, obviously, four more of these. Um, and then I think once I use these up, I'm probably going to be sick of it by then. So maybe I'll just get a different fragrance. But yeah. I also grabbed the Pumpkin Cupcake, what is this, Bath and Body Works Home Concentrated Room Spray. Uh, the lady told me at checkout that apparently now they have these sprays uh, in a larger size. I didn't realize that or see them at the time, so I just got the small one anyways. But I figure I can just use this like to freshen up a room or like if it's one of the larger rooms in the house where I don't have a candle burning or you know like the wall, um, wallflower isn't getting to it, I'll just spray this to kind of touch it up or if I just need a refresher. Because I do have three fur babies so you know every so often they get stinky stinky. So. The last two things that I have in the first bag actually aren't fall related. Um, they're just more, they're the aromatherapy uh, that Bath and Body Works uh, has like in our stores like in the very back corner of the store. So I just picked up the Stress Relief, a couple things from that line, and this is the Eucalyptus Spearmint Hand Cream. Um, I like, you know, it says relax and think. So I grabbed this hand cream just to kind of like stick in my purse and take with me. The um, Stress Relief, and this is the Eucalyptus Spearmint Luxury Bath. I wanted something that was gonna smell really nice, which this one does. It's a stress reliever on top of that, and then also this is the one, uh, the lady in the store, because I've never used these before, she was saying that they make like the really big, like luxurious bubbles in the bath. So I normally use uh, Lush products for like my bubble baths and things like that. So I figured I'd just try something else out. So I'll let you guys know how I like this and if it's going to end up being something that I repurchase. And the lady said that, you know, you could just fill like half of what this cap is up and use that for an entire bath. So it should last a while. So I'm pretty excited about this actually. <laughs> so I'm just going to move on to the last bag that I have now. So like I said, I had got a couple candles earlier in the week. So I just wanted to grab a couple more before they all got, you know, bought up and sold out and everything. So I picked up another, of course, of the um, pumpkin cupcake candle and this is th the three wick one and these, I cannot tell you like how amazing this scent is. If you have not gone and smelled it yet, you need this candle in your house if you like pumpkin or cupcakes. This is just... I love it. I wish I could just bathe in the scent all day. I'll read like the description on the bottom. It says, satisfy your sweet tooth with a scent of a freshly baked pumpkin cupcake covered in loads of rich buttercream frosting. And that's a great description because you can actually get the scent of the frosting in these candles as well, but you need one of these. Go and get it. So the next uh, rebuy that I got was the pumpkin, or I'm never gonna say that right. <laughs> was the Blueberry Pumpkin Patch. And this one, like I said, this is my favorite one that I'm burning right now, um, just because it's still that transition phase. And so it's got the, you know, fresher scent from the blueberries, but then that comforting like fall scent from the pumpkin. So this is another one that if you're looking for that nice in-between fragrance, I would highly recommend this one. The last candle that I picked up was actually the Pumpkin Caramel Latte Candle. Um, I haven't purchased this one before. I did get the hand sanitizer in it earlier on, and so I thought it smelled really good, so I thought I'd give the candle a try, and it does smell really nice. Uh, this one's a little bit more on the fall side for me. It smells very like creamy and um, just like a really comforting scent. Like anything that deals with like lattes or coffee kind of base scent, that is a very comforting scent for me. So this is definitely like one that I would like when you just want to relax and kind of just feel, I don't know, homey I guess. <laughs> so this one's another one that I really enjoy. The last two things that I have for you guys aren't super exciting. Um, I just got some little travel size. They are both in the Aspen Caramel Woods. And this one is just a body lotion. It has vitamin E, jojoba, and shea butter in it. And then I got the Aspen Caramel Woods in the Fragrance Mist. I like to carry these just like in my car. Um, I don't smoke, but I have friends that do, and so sometimes they just need a spritzer upper and they'll ask if I have body spray in the car, so I always like to keep these in um, my glove box for them. So I totally almost forgot that I told you guys I was going to um, 
film my mini like three item Forever 21 haul that I got when I got all my Bath & Body Works stuff. So I'm gonna show you those really quick. The first thing that I got from Forever 21, it's more of like, uh, to me what I wear pretty frequently in like autumn or fall whenever it's not like cold enough to need an actual jacket or even like a hoodie or just like little cardigans especially like some of the more sheer ones so this is a long sleeve one um, like I said I just got this from Forever 21 pretty inexpensive it was seven dollars and eighty cents sometimes I feel like I just need something extra just to throw on top so I love these and I feel like these are just really great and comfortable to do that and just to add another layer you know to your wardrobe for the day the next thing that I got was is <laughs> I am so addicted to high lows um, but I don't have a lace one so I picked this up it is a high low um, lace skirt I don't know how well that's going to transfer on through the camera but as you can see it's obviously more opaque here where the full part of the skirt is and then it goes down to where the lace is just draping in a high low manner uh, this one was $14.80. That's what I like about Forever 21. I can go pick up a couple really cute pieces for a pretty inexpensive price. So I got this as well. The last thing that I got from Forever 21 was sticking, you know, to me lace is a little bit more of a fall or winter type material, depending obviously on how you use it because it's not like it's going to keep you warm. But anyways, I have a lot of lace in my fall and winter wardrobe. Got this lace accented dress. So it's got just lays up top and you know kind of like a quarter length sleeve and it goes down into the actual dress where it's a little bit more opaque but I did pick this up I thought it was really pretty and this would be a really nice uh, stable piece that you could really accessorize and this was just like another inexpensive piece it was only $14.80 which I didn't think was bad for a lace little cute dress that I'll probably wear pretty frequently but that was it for my little mini um, Forever 21 haul I just thought I'd throw that in there because I bought it on the same day that I went into Bath & Body Works and it was laying around in the bags right next to that, so there you have it. So that was it for my haul. Um, I hope that you guys enjoyed seeing my repeat buys um, on all of my fall scents. Like I said, I am definitely a creature of habit, so when I like something, I definitely like to stock up on it for sure. So um, I had posted on my Instagram, my next video coming up should be a Loot Crate unboxing. If you don't know what that is, it's just like basically, you know how they do like the beauty boxes and monthly subscriptions for things like that. This is for gamers or people who like comics and stuff. And so I meant to do my first unboxing a while back when I actually stopped um, filming videos for a little while. So I'm going to unbox all three of the ones that I already have and then um, by the time that I film that video, my fourth one for this month should already be in. So I will be unboxing those for you guys. I hope that you are interested in stuff like that. Um, so yeah. But anyways, uh, my birthday is in two days on August 22nd. I will be 24 years old. And I'm, I don't know, I'm excited. I'm just like, I feel like I've hit that point where I'm like, oh, it's another birthday. I'm another year older. Yay. <laughs> um, but yeah, so I'll try and film some um, on my birthday because I'm doing stuff with my friends and, you know, just maybe like vlog that a little bit. But other than that, that's all I have for today, and I hope that you guys have a wonderful day or a wonderful evening, whatever time it might be when you're watching this, and I'll see you guys soon.